Top Mistakes That New Entrepreneurs Make Got a big new idea? Great! In all likelihood, you are probably extremely excited to bring it to market, whether it's some kind of service or some kind of physical product. Either way, though, you are now at a crossroads. People have amazing ideas all the time, but it is rare that they actually do anything useful with those ideas. All too often, those ideas don't come to anything, because the person with the said idea never takes a chance on it, or because they go about it in the wrong way. Here are some of the most common mistakes that have robbed the world of truly incredible ideas, and what you can do to prevent the same fate happening to your own innovations. 1. Not validating the idea. Validation essentially means testing that there is an audience for a product or service. Having a great idea is one thing, but having a great idea that will sell is another. And if you want to make this a business, then you need to be able to sell it. To find out, you need to do some kind of trial run. This could mean selling a beta version, taking pre-orders, or running a Kickstarter. Anything, as long as you are actively testing to see if the demand is there. 2. Not getting help. Too many inventors and innovators want to do everything themselves. Want to make a website? Then perhaps you think you have to create the logo yourself and learn HTML and Python. No! The way real professionals do it is to always outsource the most difficult parts of the process. This will save you time, and it will also result in a more professional final product, because it will be built by people who do this stuff for a living. 3. Not telling anyone the idea. Why don't entrepreneurs get help? Often, it's because they don't want to tell people their ideas. Well, that makes it very hard indeed to get funding, or even advice. If you're serious about your idea, then you need to start talking about it as soon as possible. Don't worry about people stealing your ideas. Either they have their own ideas, or they don't have the means to do anything about your idea. The best way to protect an idea is to do it first and to do it best. In other words, stop making excuses and just do it. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.